Our bait today is a chipmunk jig, and this particular jig has a built-in stinger hook or a trailer hook, and this can be invaluable when you're trolling. If fish are short biting, this will get a lot of those short biters in the boat. Now, the key to making this work, when you put your trailer on, you need to put the trailer on the front hook, and we're just gonna barely skin hook this on the front, of the, on the front hook, and then when it's in the water and it's all moving, it'll line up nice and neat like this. If the fish wants to short bite that piece of plastic, we got a big surprise for it. So chipmunk jig, six inch plastic trailer, stinger hook, great trolling bait, and we're gonna put it to use for power reeling a little bit as well. We're trolling with lead core line. Now what lead core does, it's just like the name insinuates. It's a leaded line, but it's got a Dacron sheath around it. The lead in the line is what pulls the jig down to the depth we need. And lead core is color coded. It's gonna change colors every 30 feet. And that's how you gauge how far out you are. Now in this case, we've got a monofilament leader. We've got 27 pound lead core, 20 pound mono leader to the jig. I'm going to feed the mono out and then you'll see the, actually the leg core get in. When the leg core comes off the reel, you'll see the color changes. And generally with a one ounce jig, you're going to get uh, roughly three and a half, maybe four feet of depth for every color of leg core you've got out. Uh, I prefer 27 or 36 pound leg core. It comes in, in kind of different increments if you used to monofilament, 18, 27, 36, and 45. There's very little difference in the depth between those uh, increments of pound test. Simply being the lead content's about the same. The nylon or Dacron sheath around it is where all the strength is. So the sink rates are the same. Now today we're fishing eight colors of line. And again, that puts the jig somewhere in the high 20s, maybe 30 feet, which is where most of our fish are, or a lot of our fish are. So you just count the colors as you're paying out the line. And there we're gonna get to the eighth color right there. Put the reel in here, set it in the rod holder, wait for a strike. 